Hi guys, welcome to Beach Sweat. I'm Alexa Alemania, your spin instructor for today. So what we're gonna need is obviously our bike, a bottle of water, a smart watch to calculate the times on the interval, and a rag if you're extra sweaty, which is our goal. We wanna make sure that we're burning off all that food and liquor we just ingested over the past holidays. So I hope that you guys are ready to get a great workout in. We're starting with a five minute warm up. While we're doing this warm up, I wanna make sure that we stretch. We wanna make sure that all of our muscles, our core, our back is nice and stretched out so that we can avoid any kind of injury. It's very, very important to make sure we're good and warmed up. We want to do just little, little stretches like this with a consistent speed on the bike. Make sure that your watches have been started. So we are about 30 seconds into our warm up. So we got about four to four and a half uh, minutes left and then we'll go into our first interval. So I hope you guys are ready and also let me know if you have any questions or suggestions in the comment box and I will be happy to take them into consideration. So we want to make sure that we feel that stretch in our low back, our quads, our hamstrings, our core, our shoulders, everything. We want to make sure it's nice and stretched out, nice and warmed up. But a fun fact about cycling is I worked for an orthopedic and a neurosurgeon for five years and it's one of the best uh, workouts and it puts like the least amount of impact on your knees. So it's, it's really great for that. All right, see our nice relaxing beach setting. I'm here in Florida, so it's always beach weather. So we always got to have that beach body nice and tight. So now is the time. It's a new year. It's time to get our fitness goals in. All right. Keep it going, guys. All right. We have a few minutes left into our warm up. We just want to get a nice little pace going. And then we'll be going into our first interval. So in case you guys are new to this, this is how we control our resistance right here. This little red lever. So you're going to hear me go medium to high resistance or low resistance. So to push to go up, you go higher and to lower it, you push it down. So whenever you guys hear me go up, push up. And any, anytime you hear me go low, you push it down. So just so you guys know. And we are about one minute away from finishing our warm up. So just keep up the good work. Make sure you feel nice and stretched. And we are ready to get into these intervals. I'll make sure that I give you guys a nice little countdown. So we got about 30 seconds left. Make sure that we keep it up. <sighs> Make sure we're breathing too, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Do not hold your breath during this workout. You will pass out, it's not fun. All right, and 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. All right, we're going to start with a medium to high resistance climb. So we're going to go up on our lever here. We really want to feel the stretch on this, the burn in the glutes. And we're going to be doing this for one minute. And then we're going to go into a one minute high resistance seated low pedal. We're going to do five sets of this. So we're going to feel a nice burn on this one. All right. Halfway through. Oh yeah, definitely feel the glute. All right. Keep it going, guys. Also, be sure to get water if you need it at any point of the class. All right, about 10 seconds left. And five, four, three, two, one. 
All right, now we're going to be doing a high resistance seated low pedal. All right, make sure we're breathing. Make sure our resistance is adjusted properly. All right. Even though it's a harder push, let's try to make sure we keep up a good pace. All right. Great job, guys. We got about 30 seconds left. And then we're going to be going back up. This is our first of five intervals for this round. And about 15 seconds left. Three. And back up in 10. Five, four, three, two, one. Make sure our resistance is up nice and high. This is a great glute workout. You really feel it in the glutes. We're pushing down. Getting a really good burn here. If you feel it's too easy, keep going up. You are more than welcome to go up each, uh, each round we do in this interval. All right. Halfway. About 30 more seconds. And I'll make sure to do a countdown. Breathe. We want to keep everything nice and high and tight. And 10 seconds. And 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. All right. We still want to keep the resistance high. However, when we're seated, it can be a little bit lower than when we're climbing. So make sure you adjust to your comfort. But don't make it too easy. We want to make sure we get in a great workout here. All right. You guys are doing great. All right, we got about 30 seconds left. And then we'll be going into the next round. And 15 seconds. 10, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Make sure to up that resistance. All right. We want to make this one as hard as possible. We really want to push down, feel that workout in the glutes and the hamstrings. This is a great workout for keeping everything nice and tight, nice and high. All right. And about 30 seconds left. And 20 seconds. Ten. Keep it going, guys. Y'all are doing great. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Let's adjust our resistance a little bit. Y'all are doing a great job. All right. Breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth. On this one, I feel it more in my quads. On the standing one, I definitely feel it more in the hands. Please get water if you need it. All right. We've got about 15 seconds left before we go back up. And 10. Five, four, three, 
two, and one. All right, high resistance. This part should be very difficult. I want you to really have to push down. Use those glutes, use those quads. Use those hands. Even the calves. Make sure that our back is straight, our core is nice and tight. Look at that, we're already halfway done. And back down in 25 seconds. And 15 seconds. 10 seconds. And five. Four, three, two, and one. Great job, guys. So, we only, after this one, we just have one more set, and then we go into our next interval. Make sure we're breathing, we're staying hydrated. Our form is good. All right. Let's keep the momentum going. Push through it. Remember what you put into it is what you're going to get out of it. And we're back up in 15. 10. 5. Four, three, two, and one. All right, raise that resistance. We want to make this very tough just because it's slow. Does that mean it's easy? This is where we really target building the muscle, making sure everything is nice and toned. And we're breathing. All right. The last one of these guys, make it count. And halfway. We're going to be going back down in 20 seconds. Breathe. Make sure we're breathing. And back down in 10. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Great job, guys. All right, make sure you hydrate. All right. So halfway done. Then we go into our next set. So our next set is going to consist of a minute jog climb with low resistance and a minute seated low resistance fast pedal. All right, guys. 15 more seconds. Great job. I don't know about you, but I am quite sweaty. In five, four, three, two, and one. All right, lower that resistance. Let me see you do a jog climb. Fast, fast, fast. All right, guys, we're jogging. This, unlike the first round, is about fast pace with low intensity. This is where we get our cardio. All right. Halfway there. Breathe. And we go down in 20 seconds. Fast, fast, fast. Keep those knees high. Keep that core tight. Back down in 10. Five, four, three, 
two and one. All right. Once again, low resistance, fast pedal. Fast, fast, fast. Keep that core tight. Breathe. Push through it. We want to keep the momentum high for this one. All right, high knees. Keep that core nice and tight. This is when you can get some good abs in here too. All right. 30 seconds left. Keep it going. And 20 seconds. Keep up the great work, guys. All right. And 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Jog, jog, jog. Let's see it, let's go fast. We're jogging, guys, keep up the momentum. All right. Great job. Keep it up, we're almost halfway. We are already halfway through the workout, so well done on that. And 30 seconds left of our jog. Keep going. Fast, fast, fast. Great job, guys. Keep up the energy. 20 seconds. And 15. 10. 5. 4. 3. 2. And back down. All right. Keep it fast. No breaks. You can lean forward or back. Just make sure your form is good and we're going fast. On this one, sometimes I prefer to sit up because that's, that way you can get in the abs. But keep those knees high. Keep your back straight. Keep the core tight. Keep that momentum going. Breathe. All right. 30 more seconds. Make sure to grab water if you need it. And 20 seconds. Keep it up, guys. Great job. Fast, fast, fast. Knees high. Core tight. Back straight. And 10 seconds. And back up in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's keep it fast, guys. Don't lose that momentum. You want to get a nice burn. All right. Y'all are doing great. Make sure we keep it fast. Form's good. We're breathing. All right. We want to burn. My heart rate right now is about at 160, which is where we want to keep it around to burn those calories. And about 20 seconds left. We're jogging. Back down in 10 seconds. And five, four, three, two, and one. Fast, fast, keep it fast. All right, stay hydrated. I am sweating quite a bit, so we want to make sure that we replace that fluid with water and maybe even electrolytes if we need it. I always recommend eating a banana before or after a workout to get in a good source of potassium to avoid leg cramps. Also, if you take any supplements, glutathione is a great one. It helps with the lactic acid buildup. All right. We have 20 seconds. Fast, fast, fast. Let's push it. You guys are doing great. Keep it up. High knees, fast. All right, back up in 
five, four, three, two, and one. We're jogging. See it. Keep it going. Keep up that speed. Keep those knees high. Keep our form good. All right. We are almost done, guys. We have about nine minutes left, but that includes our five-minute cooldown. So we are almost there. All right. Down in 30 seconds. Keep it up. Fast. We're jogging. We're jogging on an incline. All right. Feel the burn. Keep those beach bodies tight. Back down in 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Fast, fast, fast. Come on, guys. After this one, we have one more round, and then we do our cool down. You guys are doing a great job. Let's not lose our momentum. I know we're getting a little burnt out, but that's the point of the, uh, the fast. All right. You can even do a little twist here to really activate that core. Keep those abs nice and toned. Keep that tummy nice and flat. All right, we have about 25 seconds left before we go back up for our last round. Keep up the great work. And 15 seconds, guys. 10 seconds. And back up in five, four, three, two, and one. Let me see you jog. This is the last one, make it count. Jog, jog, jog. All right. This is where we're getting our good cardio in, our good sweat in. Let's see it. You guys are doing great. We got about 30 seconds left. Fast. Make sure we're breathing. Make sure our form is good. And back down in about 25 seconds. All right. I will make sure to count it down. 15 seconds. Fast, fast, fast. Come on, guys. Let me see you jog. And five, four, three, two, and one. All right, last one for our low interval seated fast pedal. And then we'll be going into our five minute warm up. You guys killed this exercise. Great job. All right, deep breath. And we're about halfway through. Let's keep it fast. Keep those knees high. Wanna sweat. All right. Great job, guys. Almost done. Almost there. About 25 more seconds, and then we go into our cool down. All right. And 15. Keep up the momentum. And 10. Five, four, three, Two and one. All right, guys, now for the cool down, it's very important to go maybe, we can lower, I mean, we can higher the, um, the resistance a little bit because we're gonna go at a nice and steady speed just to lower our heart rate somewhat down back to normal naturally. We wanna focus on our deep breathing and through the nose, out through the mouth. We can also do a little bit of stretching like we did for our warm up. Now, if you guys are gonna do weights after this, this is the perfect way to get your body ready for that, to avoid any injury. And if not, we just got in a great uh, low impact, high cardio workout. So great job on that, guys. And 
we got about three and a half minutes left of our cooldown here, so just keep it up. Alright. Make sure we're breathing. Go and eat something healthy after this. Maybe a nice smoothie. Make sure to drink lots of water. Like I mentioned, electrolytes, potassium. Fitness is not just about working out, but it's a lifestyle itself that you have to be committed to. So make sure you guys are doing everything possible to get that nice beach body to feel good inside and out. All right. It's good. My heart rate's starting to lower around 135 now. Just keep it nice and steady. You can even go up if you want. Stretch out the back a little bit more. Just nice and slow. You can even kind of go lean forward. All right, guys. This is a great workout. We got about two and a half minutes left of our cool down. Great job. Breathe in, out. All right. Let me know if you guys have any recommendations for the next class in the comment box. If there's anything you'd like to see, any questions, comments, or concerns, I will be reading them. And we're almost done. Got about a minute and a half left. We really want to focus on our breathing. That's how we're going to get our heart rate back down. Just remember, in through the nose, out through the mouth. All right. Great job, guys. And about a minute and a half left. All right. How many calories did you guys burn today? Also, let me know that in the comments. I am at 180. All right. Almost done. Keep breathing. Make sure we're nice and stretched out. It's going to set us up for success for the rest of the day. A fun fact is when you do cardio, your body will keep burning for the rest of the day. So that's really nice. And we are almost done. About 30 seconds left, guys. All right. Well, did a great job, and I look forward to seeing you next class. Again, I'm Alexa Azamania. You guys have a great day, and I look forward to seeing you guys again. All right. I'm going to count it down in 10, 9, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Have a great day, guys.